I used a free camp for many of my projects now and a recent update simplified the installation process and added support for the Steam version as well. So I figured now would be a good time to showcase just how easy it is to install this. The only thing you need to know is the location of your Hitman 3 folder. One way to quickly find it is by checking the file locations using Steam or the Epic Games Launcher. Then use the first link down below which will send you to this GitHub page. You don't need an account, you can scroll down a bit and you'll see there already are written instructions on how to install, but I'm gonna show how it's done as well. Next click on here and it will send us to this page. You can scroll all the way down again and the only file we need is this one. Just click on this to start the download and once it's done, you have to extract these files into the retail folder of your Hitman 3 installation. Make sure you select the retail folder or nothing will be working. When you launch the game now, you should immediately see this mod menu. If you don't, you can always turn it on or off using the key underneath escape. You'll see there are some other mods that can be selected as well, and there is this list to further explain these options, but since we're only focusing on the free cam, I'll just mark the first one. Now you can just load up any map you want and activate free cam mode. You'll see the controls for both keyboard and controller show up the first time you turn it on, which can also be toggled from the menu. And now you can freely move around. If you press a free, you can lock the free cam in its current position and take control 47 again. And that's all there is to it. If you want to uninstall this mod without having to reinstall the entire game, you need to remove all the files that we extracted into the retail folder. And lastly, this mod is fully compatible with the simple mod framework. And if you don't know what that is, I can recommend checking it out if you're interested in more ways to easily add mods to the game. Thanks for watching, and if there are any questions, just let me know.